today, you would see an extraordinary journey of the moon. All this happened 4.5 billion years ago. So, let's go 4.5 billion years in the past. A young planet, only 50 million years old. At the moment, the Earth that was much bigger compared to present had a violent collision with another planetary body having the mass approximately equal to the present Mars that is known as Thea. The time had set the Thea's orbit on a collision course with young Earth. young Earth and this planetary body collided. Tremendous amount of energy was released in this collision. The energy released was 100 million times larger than the far later event that is assumed to have wiped out dinosaurs. This event destroyed the Thea but at the same time the same event emitted large amount of ruins, that is, Earth matter including large numbers of elements, into Earth's orbit. And so, slowly, gradually, an astronomical body was formed from this Earth matter. That body we know today is Earth's only natural satellite, the Moon. stage, the newborn moon was much closer to the Earth than present. It was at a distance of just 20 to 30,000 kilometers compared to today's 3.8 lake kilometers. It would have been really beautiful to see such a huge moon near to Earth's surface, but it also had huge impact on the Earth's atmosphere and climate at that time. Still today, due to presence of the moon, there are climatic changes on Earth. The moon is still spinning away from Earth. This is because of transfer of energy from the rotation and tidal bulges of the Earth. The moon is getting 3.78 cm further away from Earth each year. So a time may come when moon would be so far away from the Earth that it won't have any contact with Earth and it might get lost in space. So will this be the end of the moon? The answer is too complicated. It may or it may not. There are many other theories, probabilities, which mentions that Moon may collide with Earth in future, but none of these can be stated, as these are just probabilities. So, should we start worrying about it? The answer is no. It would be silly to worry about an event which won't happen in next million years. So now let's see, amazing facts, about the moon. Fact 1, you always see the same side of the moon. Fact 2, scientists have discovered moon water, Indian Chandrayaan 1 mission discovered water, close to the poles of the moon. While, NASA has found water in the soil. It's less, for one cubic meter of soil, you might, extract a liter, but it increases, the possibility of one day building a base station on the moon. Fact 3, the surface temperatures reach boiling point on moon. According to NASA, the moon's temperature can span from 123 degrees Celsius to minus 233 degrees Celsius. It means surface temperature is 107 degrees Celsius in the day and minus 153 degrees Celsius at night.
Fact number 4, moon dust smells like gunpowder. The dust caused some astronauts a kind of lunar hay fever. The sneezing and congestion took days to disappear. Fact number 5, the craters can unlock space history. Without an atmosphere, the moon is not protected from meteorites. So, it's full of craters, which can really help us to explore the natural history of our solar system. Fact number 6, like Earth moon has gravity, but the moon's gravity is weaker, only one-sixth of the Earth's gravity. In fact this means, you would weigh much less, if you were, to stand on moon. Fact number 7, the moon's surface is actually, dark. It appears, white, only due to reflection of sunlight on its surface. So these were few facts from our side, if you know any, mention that in comments below. Thanks for watching this video. If you like this video, do share it, and don't forget to press bell icon. Thanks and have a great day.